yeah, the feeling of racing, it's just, um, it's just insane, honestly. Just the adrenaline rush, um, everything, like nothing on this earth can compare to it, I don't think. It's just, um, when you do get a whole shot, it's like, wow, like I'm really doing this. I'm a professional snowcross racer, full-time student athlete, so I go to school all year round. This school has allowed me to do that, play soccer, which I also love to do, and get to race snowcross. I race snowmobiles because it's just been a passion of mine ever since I started. Um, my dad used to race a while back, and then so he introduced us to the sport. Um, and actually leaving a race when I was six years old, my mom passed away. Um, so it's kind of just been like carrying on a thing that my whole family loved to do, but just taking it to the next level. So being a full-time student athlete and professional athlete, it's just, it's a lot, but I just keep looking towards my end goal. Um, my end goal for like my career is to be a nurse anesthetist. And for snowcross, I just keep looking forward to the start of the season and just keep keeping my eyes on hopefully winning a championship. And when things get hard, that's just what I think about. So I chose to come to University of Minnesota Crookston because they were going to let me keep racing. Um, I wanted to find a school that would let me play soccer and let me race. Uh, which was really hard. I visited like 15 different schools and all the coaches said like, no, you probably can't keep racing. So I was determined to find a school that would um, so I could keep doing both. So that's pretty much why I ended up here. The coach was really generous and let me keep doing both things. So I started playing soccer in August and I've been playing 90 minute full games ever since then until um, the end of October, um, but even before that I was always in the gym training all summer long um, and then even after soccer was over and during soccer I was in the gym all the time just trying to get better and better and um, focus on like everything just that I needed for snowcross and for soccer. So I think my workload definitely it kind of puts me at an advantage, but also a disadvantage, I guess, because um, everyone, all they kind of do is just, they train all year long, and then they show up and they hop on their snowmobile. And for me, I have things going on all year round, like with school, and then while I'm racing, I still have school to focus on. But after snow cross is over, then I have soccer to focus on as well. So I guess it's not really a disadvantage. I kind of like the, lifestyle that I live. I kind of think it's my dream life, honestly. Playing those long soccer games, it definitely like puts me in amazing shape to race in the I definitely feel like I have something to prove this year. Um, last year I was just a notch below um, and I feel like this year I've been training so hard and I've been doing everything I can do to just get better and better every day. Um, so this year I'm definitely hoping to win a championship and do everything I can to win a championship.